Hello, I'm Marverine Cole and you're watching International Business Times UK. Thousands of furious Egyptian football fans have taken to the streets in protest over the charges pressed against people thought to be involved in the country's worst ever soccer stadium disaster. Distraught mothers held banners of loved ones they'd lost and walked side by side with angry ultras, supporters of the Al Ali Club over Cairo's central bridge towards the High Court building. 74 people died and a thousand were injured in February after a game between Al Ali and the Al Masri Club. Rioting broke out during a post-match pitch invasion, which then led to a horrifying stampede. Many Ultras fans were said to be on the front line of anti-Mubarak protests a year ago, and some blame the police for planning the fighting after the game. Sama, whose only son, Karim Ahmed, was one of those killed, said the police aren't doing their job. She said, there's been no justice so far. The important people haven't been held accountable. The people who continue to corrupt Egypt have not been prosecuted. And we know very well who they are and we won't remain silent until all of them are imprisoned and the country is cleansed. State television said nine of the 75 people to stand trial were police officers. Two were minors who would be tried in a juvenile court. Stay here and watch more news updates. I'm Marvereen Cole. Thanks for watching International Business Times UK.